Hey guys, it's Endless. I'm playing round four in this historic popper tournament. I'm playing against Mertkan, who's our Italian friend uh, who loves the life game. So um, I think this hand isn't keepable. It's like borderline keepable. Let's see how it goes. Now oh, he's playing life gain. So we're gonna save this last gas for like a, um, a courier bat, celestial unicorn. Oh, there's the celestial unicorn. Good thing we hung on to that. Okay, unicorn, take it out. Okay, three mana, we can evoke Muldrifter, draw some cards, divination. Opponent gains a life, great. Okay, another Celestial Unicorn, that is gonna be a problem. And it's gonna get big real fast, so. I well, we gotta play to the board. Even though it's like signing your own death warrant. Seven six eight seven with Soul Mender. Damn, dude, gotta. Got to play some hard removal for this guy. Don't have enough hard removal in this deck. Damn, this is crazy. It's a big creature, yo. Um, okay, so yeah, we're basically just gonna have to chump block that thing. Um, is there a way to slow him down a little bit? Um, I think we wanna just prevent him from getting like a um, marauding blight priest. We're gonna just have to start chump blocking every turn, um, which is not great. Yep, so that's a good game. Uh, I didn't leave up another blocker. Um, okay, Celestial Unicorn, big problem. Um, we're gonna want Suffocating Fumes. Um, negate is no good in this matchup. I guess we could play an edict. Um, I think I think we're definitely not the beat down in this matchup. So devious cover up will answer some of these threats. Um, so I think we want to play this as sort of like more um, controlling style. Um, play another withering. Play another curse. Ditch of Fangs. Um,
yeah, we just really can't lose to that um, that unicorn for game two. So um, kind of need to play more control E. Um, think. Okay, that's unicorn number one. Um, all right, we do have a murder in hand, so we can afford to foretell that pack mate. Um, okay, there's a black source for the opponent and impassioned orator. Not worried about that either. Great, and we get another black source. So that turns on murder, uh, and we can dab reals if needed. All right, this needs to die on the spot. So they'll probably soul mender, um, so I'll get drained for one, but then that is forever out of the game. Um, okay, so we have murder in hand, blood, find a land, so we're going to evoke this. Okay, we got a land, and we have a blocker. Alright, so this courier bat, it is an issue. Um, four mana here. I think let's ramp a little bit. We can take some damage from the bat. We have an answer to the unicorn, so it doesn't matter. Um, Okay, I'll just deal with that unicorn. We'll take another two damage from Courier Bat. Um, barely hanging on here. Taking two from the bat.
All right, Mole Drifter in the air. Um, okay, Lunark. Okay, no Blight Priest yet. And he'll feed the swarm. He got rid of my mole drifter and not the trespassers curse. That was interesting. Um, have some flyers here that are going to be problematic. So I'm nine mana. I think we need to kill one of these flyers for three mana. So that leaves us with six mana. Um, Maybe Devious Cover-Up and Fangs into um, Classic devious cover up. Uh, shuffle that back. Let's get our life gain going here. So that should help us stabilize. Um, it's modern age first. See what we got. Um, okay, Debt to the Kami is interesting, but not right now. Um, I think we want to hang on to this murder. I don't think it's worth, um, using on the Overseer. Okay, we drew a land, so we're gonna rummage that land away. Got another land. Um, We can answer that Celestial Unicorn. We'll do it at end of turn. Just uh, cause that's the correct thing to do. All right, I'll take a pack meet. Need to shuffle that murder back in if we uh, devious cover up again. Come on, pack me. Let's go. Ooh. 
We're not out of the woods yet. I still could lose here if he has a really good top deck. Um, okay, that's not a really good top deck. What I want right now is like suffocating fumes. That would be really good. We stemmed the bleeding from Inspiring Overseer. Um, we're not out of the woods yet. All right, well, this deserves an Elspeth. Unfortunately, all of those Lunarchs are gonna turn into um, 1-1 one, one flyers, but I don't think he has enough mana to really power that. That was a great top deck. All right, so I'll be, I'll, he'll start to drain me with Blight Priest, which is good for him, but um, so what he gets Two more drains. So he doesn't gain any life because of Trespasser is curious, but he'll take me down. No, it's just it's just even. So these are just chumps. Um if he blocks with a bunch of things, then um maybe he gets the the gain life from stuff dying. Um I'm really glad we double scribed there. Maybe I should have held that. Um, that Bajuka bog, but I don't think he's going to block with Blight Priest and these guys are going to exile, so it didn't matter. Okay, I guess I didn't do my math right there. I could have forced him to block. Okay, um, barely surviving in that one, but um, yeah, we somehow managed to do it. Um, so we're gonna be on the draw. The, uh, the flyers were an issue. Um, the little guys were an issue. Um, we don't want to, I don't think we want to add in another draw spell. But we could play another stinging shot. I don't think Owlberry is doing that much for us. Uh, yeah, I think stinging shot will take out one of those flyers. Could be helpful. Um, let's do that. Okay, um, I can't really ask for a better hand than that. Um, we have early interaction, we got our blue source right there, so love it. My opponent missed their one drop, so okay. impassioned orator. So you know what, let's foretell because even if it's a unicorn, we can still last gasp it. Um, and it's not. And there's no bear. So. But just to be careful, I think I'm gonna play the green stories here and hold up um, Dabrielle's. But I am still, I'm definitely the, um, I'm not the beat down this game. Not yet, anyway. All right, so if he taps out for another unicorn, we can last gasp it. Let's get 
some trumpeting hertz going and try and generate some momentum. Um, okay, Blight Priest. Uh, no problem. That's Visionary. Last Gasp. Swing in for six. Alright, another Blight Priest. And no lands. Alright. We got six mana here. I'm gonna just kill the Blight Priest. And, um, Devious cover up whatever my opponent decides to do, and then we win. Um, yeah, no, we're just gonna counter that. I mean, that kind of sucks, 4 mana counter spell for a 1 mana dork, but um, he does have Disturb. Plus one, plus O oh, gains lifelink and returns to the battlefield. So my opponent lives with one life. Took out my pack mate. All right, we're gonna mull drifter here. Leave up a black. I think that is good game there. Um, I think the sideboard strategy we took, paid off. Um, Ooh. Okay, took down, uh, took down Mr. Life Gain. So, um, coming out of that round, um, I think we are three and one. So in the last round, we um, had an unfortunate loss to Azorius Blink, but the deck was still super cool. So, um, happy to lose to such an interesting deck. But um, yeah, standard black white life gain with Carrier Bat, not a cleric tribal. Managed to uh, grind it out with a more controlly sideboard plan. So, um, good game, and I'll see you for the final round.